Yo, what's going on guys? Mark Place here coming at you guys again with another guest. In this one, we're going to be bringing you the best coin making guide on all of YouTube. So, this one, this get oh, Mad Mobile 20 dude, it is popping. I like I'm not going to lie, when I first downloaded it, I was not feeling it at all. Um, but the more I'm playing it, the more it's like bringing back memories of like past Maddens and it, this is honestly one of my favorite ones they've ever made. Uh it has potential to be the best, but we really got to see what these promos are looking like. Um, but anyways, uh, this is the league, just a little update. We're full right now, but you can still request, obviously. And the second someone leaves, I basically just pick whoever has the best statistics to join the league next. Um, so definitely request there. You might be waiting for, like, a couple hours, but usually there's like, someone leaves during the day, so whatever. Um, but, yeah, first off, we're going to be uh, hopping into the Master Series events for Juju Smith-Schuster to start off. Um, you guys are going to get so much rewards for this. I think in total... It's probably, honestly, like 100,000 coins or more um, if you pick. So, like, you're going to come across chests while you're playing this. Um, and each time, there's going to be coins as an option. I think, like, three or four times, you're going to see chests that are containing, like, 10,000 coins, 5,000 coins, 2,500 coins. So, that's, like, 17,500, almost 20,000 coins per chest. Um, so, definitely claim those and make sure you go for the, the chests um, and the, the gold in the chest every time. So... Uh, next off, uh, well, we got to help our league mates real quick. Um, but the daily goals that just popped up, you're, these are actually only going to give you XP, um, which is kind of a common misconception. They don't actually give you gold. Uh, however, that Madden bonus pack, I think, does sometimes give you gold. So um, definitely hit that one up. Uh, however, the achievements, though, um, they do actually give you gold. Uh, I think those are mainly... For like the Madden history event, if you guys remember the oh it says team history, um, these ones do give you gold. So just like completing every one of the the teams, it's only 500 gold, but you also get the coins along the way for just completing all those achievements. So that's a pretty good way of making coins as well. Um, and then the Madden gems for the just like the other achievements, um, which you can come over to the store and spend for some new packs, um, and then, like, this one, if you, I think there's, like, a, yeah, an 11% chance of getting a 75 overall, or over player, if you do happen to get that one, that's gonna be great, Re uh, return your investment there, um, you're gonna be making a ton of coins for, for getting the 75 overall, or higher, especially an 80 overall, um, especially if it's that, if that promo, but there's also a bunch of other good promos, uh, definitely the all pro packs are pretty good, I actually just pulled, like, a 82 overall safety from that one, um, and then just a little side note, um, make sure you guys are selling your, this is the card I pulled, um, uh, make sure you guys are selling your gold players on your team, um, because th those are honestly like in one month, those are going to be worth nothing. Um, so get those out of the way fast because, well, they're still worth something because you can make a killing just selling your gold players. And I, I'm pretty sure by this time, if you guys haven't sold them, you should have quite a few saved up. And those are going for like 5k a piece at least. And that's just for a 70 overall. If you have anything over a 70 overall, it's even higher. Um, but just quickly in the league store, you can also make some coins. Just I'd recommend getting the Vance McDonald first, but after that, get the Madden Gems. And then as your league does level up, you can exchange it for the All-Pro Packs or the 20,000 coins. Um, so just join a high-level league if you can. Um, I don't think any leagues are actually up there yet, um, but they will be soon. So that, that'll come into play uh, once the season starts, like the legit NFL season. Um, but anyways, going to be hopping back into the auction house and just showing you guys um a couple filters that start to work um so you got to go for really just a common search um so it's almost like it's like a youtube video just like a common search term um so like goals for uh, the lowest amount of coins is obviously a really popular search term um so i think the lowest one i could find here uh is looking around like four thousand mid so like 4500 coins or so so that's what these gold players are selling for now. If you want to take a gamble, you can buy out like 4,100 and 4,200 and hope that they sell throughout the day. Um, but I th if you find one over a 70 overall, you are going to want to buy that one, especially if it's like uh, 72, 73. 71 isn't too much of a, a difference, but 72 is fairly drastic. So I definitely recommend buying those players up whenever you see them. Um, and honestly, if you buy any player under 5,000, uh, coins, it's probably going to bring you a return on your investment throughout the day because 
the gold, the value of players obviously fluctuates throughout the day. Um, but at some point during the day, they're, they are going to be worth quite a bit more than they are now. Um, and you can, any betting man knows that's a fact. So definitely uh, invest in some gold players. I'd say early in the morning um, as there's less players on. Um, and then like when players first log on, they start throwing them up. Uh, so there's not as many people in the auction house and there's more players on the auction house. So buy them up in the morning and sell them throughout the day. Like usually around noon, is like the hottest time. Um, but then once again, just going over, taking out your gold players. I'm going to be showing you right now how much I'm going to get for my gold players. Um, so we're just going to check and see, uh, I believe that, yeah, wide receivers. I have two of them. So, oh, right now, boom, this is a perfect example, guys. Just buy these guys up immediately. That's a 71 overall and a 72 overall just sniping you guys can honestly just refresh the auction house it usually refreshes every like five minutes or so um so those are great snipes i'm going to show you in just a minute how much i'm going to make off those uh, but th those are those are really good snipes i wouldn't recommend getting this guy because um it's just not as good as a of a pole as you'd like to see but it's all good um so what are we looking at now all right these are pretty good so we can actually end up selling our guys for around like we're going to sell them for $52.99 because that's just one coin under the lowest guy. So, of course, they're going to buy us over um, that guy. So, put these guys up real quick. Uh, just like that, we made, like, over 10,000 coins. Just players off our, off our team that uh, doesn't even make our team that much worse getting them off the team. Um, and that 10,000 coins is obviously going to be worth quite a bit more down the road. So, now we're going to be selling our 71 overall that we just picked up. Seeing how much that thing goes for. Uh, oh, sweet. That's awesome. We can actually... Should we buy this Jordan Matthews? I think I think it might be worth it. Um, but yeah, anyways, if we get rid of the Jordan Matthews, then that's only 7,300 um, coins for the lowest. So we can actually end up selling two of them for like 72.99 or something like that. Um, but yeah, so that's obviously a decent snipe on Jordan Matthews and a great snipe on uh, the other one. So... I can't remember who that was. It's the speedy guy from the Patriots. What's his name? Cordero Patterson. Um, but yeah, anyways, how much are we selling this? Oh, wow, that's perfect. Yeah, guys, this this 72 overall snipe is a perfect one. I think that they'll definitely be selling for 11K, but maybe we can sell them for, yeah, we can sell them for like 93.99. So that's perfect. Oh my gosh, what a pull. So I think we just, we literally just more than doubled our investment on that guy. Like that, that's, that's so good. This filter's working right now. Um, as more people start to use it, I think it could honestly still work. Because I think there are multiple auction houses um, going on. So you guys should still be able to use this. Um, but yeah, you guys just saw how much we made from that. That's pretty crazy. But the next tip, we're going to be going into the live events. Um, you're going to be want to be looking for the Madden Mint one. It's not always up. It's not up right now. But in like an, an hour 22, as you can see, once it refreshes, it'll probably be up. So if that one's up, literally just play it as much as you can. You can literally make 20 to 30,000 coins so easily, so fast, only using like part of your stamina. So that is probably the fastest method in the game to um, actually like make the most coins. Um, but the only problem is that that can only happen every now and then. Uh, it's not too steady. And then also going to the front office, they call it investing. You can kind of um, put in like real money into these to get like, see like a 25% coin boost. Um, so that's just kind of like a cheap little way of doing it. But obviously we don't want to be spending real money because that's kind of, I don't, I don't want to say a rip off, but it's just, there's better ways of making coins. Um, but I think those are the majority of the ways to um, gain coins in Madden Mobile 20. Um, so just remember to sell all your gold players um just a reminder this is the filter that you're going to want to be looking for is the 70 overall golds for now um but yeah reminder to sell all your gold players if you have any elite players oh my god sell those immediately what are you doing holding on to those guys get those out of your lineup right as we speak um you definitely don't want to be holding on to those for so long because they're making a killing on the auction house i think the lowest one's going for like 90k right now uh so obviously Great ways to make coins, super early, we love it. Uh, make sure to like this video, subscribe if this helped you guys out, and I'll see you in the next one. Make sure to apply to the lead because we're gonna be adding in 